he throws me in the car and I start kicking. New at six, a frightening experience for a Chula Vista teenager. A man pulled her into his car while she was walking her neighbor's dog Saturday. And tonight, that man is still on the loose. Tennis reporter Steve Fiorina joins us live on this story. And Steve, the dog actually helped her escape that dangerous man? He certainly did. She was walking him along G Street here. That car pulled up. The driver jumped out, grabbed her, and threw her across the front seat. He was standing like this when the dog came back and jumped on him as he was... Uh, Bothered by the dog, she crawled out underneath, and then they both ran away. Joanna Borges says she doesn't want to sleep now, afraid of reliving the real-life nightmare of Saturday afternoon. It's something that scarred me, and I just, I just don't want to remember. I don't want to have bad dreams. She was walking this Australian cattle dog, Willow, as a favor to her grandmother's mobile home park manager. Suddenly, the driver of a black Camaro blocked her path. He runs out of the car and, and bear hugs me, throws me in his car, and while all that happened, I lost grip of the leash. Willow ran away and Joanna started fighting. She doesn't remember if she screamed. I start kicking, trying to move him away from me, and luckily well, Willow saw that we weren't being friendly with each other and, and she throws herself on him. And because she did that, he, was, he moved out of the way and I ran and she ran behind me and we were able to get home safe. The kidnappers sped away. Joanna and Willow have bonded. She's your buddy for life now. Oh yeah. Yeah, she's became somebody so important because if it wasn't for her, I wouldn't be here. Joanna's mom thanks God that her daughter is safe and she appreciates Willow too. Oh, my daughter will love it forever. <laughs> she's so um, thankful with the dog and she says that he will love the dog forever. Well, so grateful Chula Vista police are working with a sketch artist to try to get that out, hopefully by tomorrow. Live in Chula Vista, Steve Fiorina, 10 News.